So two incision cat castrate. So we do our first incision over the testicle. We use a number of blade until we can just pop it out. And then we don't go through incisions through the tunic here because where the attachments are, we go on the underside here. Gently go down the tunic so it pops out the tunic. And now we've got the vessel called the epididymis. We just want to detach the attachment at the epididymis like that. And left with cord and vessel, which we now separate. I tend to keep the epididymis on the cord, give me an extra length. You can either break it or you can actually nick it with a blade. And then we just put our ties in. Make sure they go in nicely. Do one more, and then you can see them, all the little knots stacked up. So make our incision about a centimetre past the last knot, about there. So same with the other testicle, a bit of squeeze, and just run the blade over the skin the testicle pops out that. and then we just go through the underside here not the attachment side to the tunic and now you can see the vessel called the attachment let's take away the attachment from the epididymis cord and vessel which we separate I'll break this bit off, off there and then we just use the cord and vessel to do our ties just check they're going in well no skin attached to it or anything. Show you a trick if ever you're running out of one of them or it snaps um, and you haven't got much uh, length to do so for example this is snapped and we've only got a small piece left so we can't do our ties just use the forceps like that And just go around tying the testicle. See I've got more here. I'm just demonstrating if it broke early. It's effectively sort of lengthens. It allows you to get more on. Go back to how we were. Let's do 
feel well now. Nah. Now you can see them all stacked up. And we had a centimetre past the last knot and check everything's okay and gone back in, whittled it back in. Like um, if ever it goes wrong and what you do is just put a ligature on and um, for whatever reason you can't put the ties on. Um, as long as you've got probably at least five on you're okay but uh, if you've got a two or three it's probably worth putting a ligature on. Um, just some two knot, some uh, two metric three knot Vicryl. Um, 